If I could go back in time and really understand my faith and the resources that I've been given differently, I wish that I would have known that the things that I am given can be used to build the kingdom and to grow my faith and the faith of those around me. I don't think I knew that growing up. I think I believed that what I was given was for me. Um, and now I realize that what I'm given is not for me. Um, it's for others. And things as simple as building a business can be used for my community through alternative employment models or taking the profits and giving them to a donate, donating them to a charity or using whatever platform I have to elevate the voices of someone who's marginalized and doesn't have a voice in society. Those are responsibilities that I have as a privileged person. Uh, and I don't know that I realized that my education and everything that I received from my place of privilege could then be turned and used to bring privilege to others. Um, and so especially for students, I always encourage them, you know, as you're learning and growing, and thinking about business and what you want to do when you grow up, since you're basically almost there. Um, <clears throat> think about how that opportunity and what you've learned can be used to make your community and society better and more whole and lead people back to their own faith, whatever that looks like. Not religion, not a specific thing, but how do we introduce people to faith and love and hope and the things that we need to survive on the earth. <laughs>